there's no way to jumpstart the facial nerve. So we don't start working at the very beginning after surgery because there isn't any, there's not enough healing yet. There isn't enough electricity flowing through that nerve. I, I kind of tell people it's, it's like if you break your leg, the, the bone is broken, it goes in a cast, and you wouldn't even dream of doing any therapy on it until the bone heals and the cast comes off. Every person is individual, and so every person is evaluated as an individual, and the facial exercises and movements that are done will be specific to that person. One of the things that can happen is the facial nerve can overcorrect, and so six, eight, 10, 12 months down the line, the person may actually develop spasms or hyper contraction in their facial muscles. So on the affected side, the face can actually start to look like this a little bit at rest. The first thing we work on is stretching and massaging, and we call it soft tissue mobilization, to make those tissues supple again because they can become very, very tight. And just like you wouldn't go for a run on a leg that has a spasm or a cramp in it, you can't easily move your facial muscles if there are cramps. So that's the first course of action. Let's get the tone supple and equal to the unaffected side. And then from that point forward, we can start to work on the coordinated movement patterns so that only the muscles that are supposed to be activated during a particular expression are activated and all of the other muscles are quiet and subdued. I'm a partner with the patient in developing the, what we call the home program because I'm only with a person for a very limited period of time, but then that person goes home and works on their home program on their own. They take no notes during the therapy and they have very a very specific regimen that they follow every day. The entire course of retraining lasts somewhere between 18 months and three years. And it sounds like a very long time, but how long does it take to get good at doing something, some kind of a motor skill that you don't already know how to do? How long would it take to get good at learning how to play piano, for example?